Welcome back to my YouTube channel Score and Shine. Before getting into the video, I wanted to tell you something regarding this channel. This channel was initially started to help Tamil Nadu agriculture students who are in race to crack agriculture competitive exams. In the meantime, our team has found that many other students in other states too who do not understand Hindi are in need of content to crack agriculture competitive exams and hence in that basis we started giving content in English so that it will use it will be useful for all the other states too. Now let us get into the video and today's video is all about sunflower. The scientific name of sunflower is Helianthus anus and it belongs to the family Compositae or Astraceae and its origin is from South America and Mexico. It is a day neutral plant where intermediate day length of 12 to 14 hours is required for its growth and the germination you can find in sunflower is epigeal germination where the cotyledons of the seeds remain above the soil during its germination and you can find oxen activity is more in the apical portion of the sunflower and hence because of this you can find sunflower moving towards the direction of sunlight and the oil content in sunflower seeds is 45 to 50 percent which is the very good source of polyunsaturated fatty acids like linoleic acid which is nearly 68 percent and this oil is very suitable for heart patients because it has the capacity to reduce the cholesterol level in the body and sunflower oil is also very good source of vitamin E and in sunflower you can see highest seed multiplication ratio which is more than 1 is to 80 and the optimum temperature required for growing sunflower is 20 to 25 degrees celsius and the head of sunflower is called as capituli or capitulum and this consists of two florets ray floret and disc floret ray floret is the yellow colored one which mainly attracts pollinators for pollination and disc floret which is in the middle portion consists of male and female flowers which form seeds and protoandrous nature was seen in sunflower where the male flower matures first and the time difference between male and female flower's maturity is nearly 18 to 24 hours. The chief pollinator of sunflower is honeybees. Chaffiness refers to the non fruiting of sunflower seeds and the fruit of sunflower is acne where head of sunflower is called as capituli or capitulum and the fruit of sunflower is acne. And the important varieties of sunflower are modern, Juala Muki and Sunrise Selection. Modern is rough and also short duration variety. While coming on to seed rate, 6 to 8 kgs of seeds per hectare is required. As sunflower can be grown in all the three seasons, Karif, Rabi and Summer, the recommended spacing for all the three seasons are for Karif season 45 into 30 cm, for Rabi season 15 to 20 cm, and for summer 16 to 30 cm. And here comes the critical stages for both nutrient and irrigation management. That way, seedling stage is critical stage, and the next is bud initiation stage, which is also called as knee eye stage and buttoning stage is also a critical stage and the next is flowering stage and the next is seed development stage. These stages are critical for both nutrient and irrigation management. And now let us see the important insect pests and diseases of sunflower. While coming on to insect pests, Capitoli borer, head borer which is the most serious pest in sunflower where the larva initially feeds on the leaves and it bores into the capitulum or the head of the sunflower and feeds on the developing seeds and it destroys ending up the sunflower head getting rotted and while coming on to Bihar hairy caterpillar and tobacco caterpillar both the Bihar caterpillar, Bihar hairy caterpillar and tobacco caterpillar gregariously feeds on the under surface of the leaves and leads in defoliation and destroys the entire field and it drastically reduces the yield. And while coming on to leaf hoppers, leaf hoppers suck the sap in the plant and the leaves 
and end up in yellow coloration and that leads to the reduction in yield and while coming on to the diseases alternadia blight rust downy mildew and rhizophus headrod are the important diseases powdery mildew is also an important disease in sunflower in rhizophus headrod where the head region which has been attached to the stem of the sunflower gets rotted and the entire head of the sunflower rotted and it falls down and that's all for today thank you so much for watching this video do like share and comment and if you for watching my video for the first time do subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to click the bell icon too you can also join to my telegram channel score and shine i'll keep the link of the telegram channel in description you can go check it out there and if you have any doubts you can just ask in the comments or you can also message me in the telegram thanks for watching thank you so much